water and our decoction is ready! This recipe is proven to lower creatinine levels in kidney patients by 5 points or more! But only 1% of patients are actually doing this! They are those who can reverse kidney disease! Karen here, there is a huge problem the world is facing right now no one is talking about the kidney disease epidemic kidney disease is causing every day more deaths than breast cancer and prostate cancer kidney disease is the most under recognized public health crisis here comes the worst part Every time a patient is diagnosed, their doctor will always tell them the same thing. There is nothing we can do. We have to wait for dialysis. But this is not true for everyone. Some patients have found ways to avoid dialysis even in the advanced stages. The 1% of patients is actually reversing chronic kidney disease. Yes, there are ways to beat kidney disease and I've seen people doing it. This is why I want to focus on the solution rather than the problem. In the last 10 years of my career, I've spent countless hours researching case studies and life stories of people who are able to avoid dialysis. I've talked to patients who were able to lower their creatinine levels in the advanced stages of kidney disease, even when their doctor told them it was not possible to do so. This is why in today's video I want to show you what the 1%, the patients who are able to reverse kidney disease, are doing. There are 4 good habits that will make all the difference. Keeping your kidneys free from toxins, chemicals, and harmful substances is key if you are serious about repairing your kidneys. What many people don't know is that keeping your mind free from toxic thoughts is just as important. A positive mindset. Never underestimate the power of your mind. Keeping toxins away from your mind may be just as important as keeping them away from your kidneys. I want to explain this in the words of one of you guys. My name is Joseph and I've been diagnosed with CKD 4 years ago. At the time my GFR was around 27. My labs were a mess and I had no idea anything was wrong. My function was getting worse over time despite all the pills I was taking. I was hovering around 17 or so. This lasted for 3 years until I started following your channel. I cannot express in words how much hope you gave me. I never knew there are things you can do to slow down kidney disease. I've turned my life around. In just 8 months, I was feeling better than I ever did in the last 4 years. Then I went for a blood test. Two months ago and my doctor was very glad to let me know that my GFR was back at 41. Okay guys, this is a message from Joseph, one of my subscribers. He was in stage 4 and he was able to reverse kidney disease thanks to the habits he developed in just a few months. And all this thanks to an improved mindset. He found hope and he was able to get better. And while finding hope in a difficult situation is not as easy as it sounds, the mindset is actually proven by science to be a deciding factor for the outcome of a chronic illness. Recent research even went a step forward saying that a positive attitude may actually be necessary to overcome a serious illness. Another reason why a positive mindset may be the key to reverse this disease is the ability it gives you to think outside the box. Thinking outside the box is exactly what brought us one of the most significant advancements in the field of kidney disease treatments of the last years. There is only another organ in the body that can take care of removing uremic toxins, the wastes that damage the kidneys. Improve your digestive health to support your kidneys. Here's another one of the things only the 1% of patients are able to do. One of the most powerful detoxing habits in the world is letting your gut removing uremic toxins instead of your kidneys. And taking a probiotic supplement is definitely the fastest way to do so. Fact, according to science, 
Probiotic can speed up the way your gut gets rid of uremic toxins. When your gut is healthy, it will be able to help consistently with getting rid of what your kidneys can't remove. Uremic toxins in particular are a great burden for your kidneys and your body and removing them through the gut is a win-win situation. Now, achieving the incredible result of being able to remove uremic toxins through the gut and protect the kidneys on the long term is not easy. Finding the right probiotic supplement may be challenging. This is why many people ask me, how can I find a probiotic that really helps the kidneys? Not many probiotics are made with the needs of kidney disease patients in mind. This is why on my website, newhopeforkidneypatients.com, you can find the only probiotic supplement made from a kidney patient for kidney patients. This is a product I personally endorse because it really works. Robert, the owner of this brand, is a sufferer of kidney disease and an internationally known kidney health expert he has helped thousands of people taking better care of their kidneys and this is why this probiotic supplement is one of the most advanced formulations you can find. The probiotic microorganisms in this one use harmful kidney toxins like urea, uric acid, creatinine and other waste as nutrients for growth. This will support normal toxin load elimination from the body and kidney. And it's the only supplement on the market that also contains sodium bicarbonate, a must for kidney health because it protects the kidneys from acidity, and also niacin and niacinamide. These are two forms of vitamin B3 that have the special benefit of blocking the absorption of phosphorus in the gastrointestinal tract. Yes, this is a supplement that can really make a difference. Check my video description for more info about it. Okay guys, time to see the special tea I was showing you in the beginning of the video. This is a special preparation that has shown incredible benefits for the treatment of diabetic kidney disease. In a very recent review of 24 studies involving 1,918 participants, those drinking a tea similar to this every morning had a huge drop in creatinine levels and they were also able to lower their proteinuria and cholesterol levels significantly. This is Panax Noto Ginseng. Ginseng is mostly used as an alternative or complementary version of caffeine. Many people seem to really love the powerful energy this remedy can provide and its amazing taste. What not many people know about this remedy is its amazing kidney protecting benefit. Ginseng has been used for centuries to treat pain thanks to its anti-inflammatory properties. Research shows that the antioxidants found in ginseng are effective at protecting the organs from inflammation. It can also boost blood flow, which is an amazing way of improving kidney function and lower cholesterol levels according to studies. And while there are many types of ginseng roots available, not all of them are good for you. Question, which type of ginseng is best for kidney function? As you can see here, I have the three most common types of ginseng. This is American ginseng. It's the last strong of the three when it comes to health benefits and it has a relaxing effect. This one in the middle is Panax Red Ginseng. This is the most potent type of ginseng, but it's also the most expensive and harder to find. Panax Ginseng is actually one of the most powerful antioxidants in the world, and it's really effective at protecting the kidneys though. This is why I've made a full video about it. It's up here if you want to know more. And what I want to show you today is this one here. This is called Noto Ginseng and while it has some of the benefits of Panax Ginseng, it is a different remedy, mostly used today for its circulation and blood sugar lowering benefits. Yes, while every single kidney disease patient may benefit from this powerful herbal remedy, those suffering from diabetes are going to get incredible results. Question, 
How do you prepare a ginseng tea that works? First, you need to find good panax noto ginseng. Larger roots are usually more pricier and better than smaller pieces. Now, dried ginseng is very hard to cut, but if you boil some water and steam the ginseng for 5 minutes, it will become very easy to cut in pieces. To make a ginseng tea that really helps with kidney function, we need to prepare a decoction. A decoction is what naturopaths do to make herbal ingredients more powerful. Ginseng pieces need to soak in water for 2-4 to four hours before making the tea, or even overnight. Now they're ready to boil. When the water boils, reduce the heat and let simmer for about 1 hour. Strain the ginseng, saving the water. This is our first decoction. Add another batch of water and repeat for the second decoction. Mix the first and second batches together. Keep the decoction in the fridge and drink within 4 to 5 days. Guys, it's clear that finding a remedy perfectly tailor suited for you needs such as noto ginseng for diabetes is not easy. It's something only the 1% of patients can do, but the results can be really amazing as we have seen. This is why if you want to know more about remedies and tips, to help with diabetic kidney disease, this video up here is for you. If you have to deal with high blood pressure, watch this video up here. And this is all for today. Thank you for watching.